there are the girls again. Hey there everyone, welcome back. So today I am off to Sri Lanka. This flight is gonna be roughly around nine hours going to Incheon. From Incheon, I'm gonna take a connecting flight to Colombo. That's gonna be around eight hours. So in total, with the layover, maybe around close to 24 hours I'll be traveling. Today I feel a little lighter, like maybe I packed lighter. I don't feel like I packed that much lighter. Maybe I'm just happier, who knows. Today is just a very hot and humid day. This global warming is brutal, man. Hawaii used to be like perfect, perfect weather, and now it's, it's all around there. <gasps> AC. So I'm gonna get to fly with Korean Air, and I love Korean Air. So my mom packed me. Ooh, hash browns and musubi. Reclining on this. I don't like sitting on the back. Oh, they give you water. This is why I love Korean air. This must be like slippers. Oh my god, look how spacious that is. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem right there. Don't be that person. <laughs> Oh my god, seriously? This is so you don't have to share earwax with other people. just asked my seat neighbor what this was and she said this is pickled cucumber so this is very very crunchy as Koreans didn't have a refrigeration so they had to pickle and ferment a lot of their side dishes and stuff like that when you look at the whole balance of the meal it's really interesting because you kind of got this fresh sort of salad with rice right that's very spicy and then you got the vinegar taste along with this earthy type of soup to write home about. There's very little sauce on it. The cheese isn't as gooey, but I like that there's vegetables in it because I'm even surprised that they had this option. I think this is mozzarella cheese. It's soft. I like the salad. There's arugula in it, which has got a nice firm bite. Definitely more thought going into the salad than maybe the pasta. Not really a bread person, but it definitely smelled a whole lot better than it tasted. Here we are in Incheon, Korea. Wow, so right now we're in Terminal 2. So far the design is pretty nice. Very nice. Ooh, there's a free transit tour. Oh, they're at all different hours. This is free? Aw, wow. Hello, Terminal 2 Incheon Airport. Can I live here? Right up here, there's a transfer lounge. Let's check that out. This is cool, it's like a, yeah, this is a lounge area. You can kind of like sit on these little lounge chairs. There's a digital gym. 
stepping challenge, shooting challenge for kids. So it's like fun, jumping challenge. Let's see what this is. Start. What makes this do? This is a digital workout. There's a lot of like digital games where it's designed to make you move, I think. But doing this with a backpack like this, it's kind of hard. These are cool. I read that these are free showers. I could use a shower and I probably will come back to take one. You just come in here, freshen up. The only thing is I wonder if there are towels. This is the Korean Toto toilet. Different features, though not completely different. There's an internet section. Apparently this is it. Wow, this is really cool. And a nap zone. You can charge. This is so cool. Like you don't even need to rent a hotel. You just come here and rest, provided there are like available seats. The design of this place is just gorgeous. It's very aesthetically pleasing, very mellow, relaxed feeling. Sometimes you just have to say why, but then this is Korea. So it's more like, why not? Ooh, they have a pharmacy. SK, your telecom services there, and Jamba Juice. I've seen these robots. Unfortunately, this robot is sleeping right now and he's charging his system. Ordinarily, I guess he would just like answer whatever questions you have. Now I'm gonna take a quick shower and then go back to my gate. Towel. Okay, now that I'm all feeling all refreshed and spruced a little from that shower, now I'm ready to catch my flight. So it's around 10 o'clock right now. A lot of the shops are closed, or all of the shops are closed. Okay, second leg right here. Flight slippers and a toothbrush and toothpaste. That's pretty cool. So you've got rice and some soybean paste. That smells really delicious. You can smell the soybean. This is gonna mix in with this. We've got seaweed soup, pickled cucumber, and dessert. Looks like some potatoes, some chili, some kind of squash in there. There might be some bits of meat in here. I'll have to pick it out. Taking these Korean Airlines flights just reminds me of how much I miss Korean food. The soybean paste kind of smells a little bit like the gochujang sauce, which is kind of like that red paste that I had in my other flight. Really good. The paste is like a strong paste. Oh my gosh, it's really good. It's a little salty, not too spicy. I'm gonna go dip into the seaweed soup, a very clear broth. Seaweed soup isn't that bad. It's lightly salted, you can taste the seaweed. It's a different kind of flavor because this is a heavy kind of fermented flavor. And this one is just kind of like a light broth that kind of like wipes everything away. Oh, box pizza. Yes. Oh, let me try that. Thank you. Sri Lanka travel playlist for more travel videos about Sri Lanka and join me weekly for more girl traveler videos. As always, links in the description box below. Until then, travel safe, smart, and fun, and may the girl be with you.